Look at this goofiness right here. Now, this is exactly what I'll be talking about. Now, y'all know me and Dietrich Haddon have gotten to it in the past. He made some lyrics, and it was very secular. It was very disgusting. And, of course, he would post something like this. And so this is exactly what I'm talking about. Just because someone's talent has allowed them to be in a place where they represent Christianity to the world, it does not mean they are kingdom. And this is the problem that I have. This is what why I talk about the things that I talk about because you got goofy people like this all right who present this stuff to the world and then it makes the kingdom look crazy right people like me talking about Beyonce taking you know bible pages and stuffing them in her you know what at that time of the month then you got people like him coming and defending you know what I'm saying like they just be kissing the butt of the world you know if you want to see what what bowing down is what selling out is that's these cats that's why they don't stand for nothing look the only time he speak up and he with all the crazy evil stuff going on in the world he want to come to the defense of Beyonce that's a clown right there and I'm gonna keep saying it the baby all these people who are making a mockery, you know, of, of Christianity, and then these other Christians who defend it or don't speak up. That's foolery. That's clownery. It is what it is. And somebody got to say it. Now, I know a lot of people, they're not going to speak about it. And the reason they're not going to speak about it is because a lot of people, people want to be stars. I don't want to say nothing about this one and this one because this one is friends with that one and I'm trying to make it in the Christian industry, all right? All I'm trying to do is be in the kingdom, but people are trying to make it in the Christian industry so they don't have the backbone to speak up because the gatekeepers, they're going to block you, right? They're going to stop you from getting in. I don't care what nobody say. Read the Bible. Look at the Bible, all right? God would not approve of this foolery, all right? They said, oh, gospel artists have been sampling secular songs and turning them gospel for decades. Yeah, the clowns. The ones who love the world, who want to have the world, you know what I'm saying, in the in the, in the in their music. And it's obvious. Think about it. Look at who's saying this. And then Beyonce's mom, you know, she she posted. It's just ridiculous. She says, gospel singer Dietrich Hayden has a message for the hypocrites. He's the hypocrite. That's he's the fake hashtag fake holy. He's the fake holy. And the Bible says, you know what? The God of this world going to have people's minds blind and they can't see it. They can't, they think we're just being religious. Just let that sink in. Go look at some of Dietrich Hayden's lyrics. Go look at some of the TV shows he's involved in. Dude is a whole goofy. Hey, I said, I know, I know some of y'all don't like that. But like, they're so bold. And, and people, it's the same thing like with the tank thing. People are in the comments thinking he ate. He ain't ate. Go look, go, go, go look at the Bible, read the Bible, and then go look at these people who represent Christianity. And see if they're moving how they moved in the Bible. For a lot of these people, Christianity is simply a business. It's a way to make money. They wasn't good enough to make it in the world, so they did gospel. They wasn't good enough to rap in the world, so they did Christian rap. But it's not really in their heart. They really don't love the Lord like that. They're really in love with the world. That's why when you go to the Stellar Awards and the Dove Awards, you got people getting drunk. You got people twerking and looking just like the world, acting like just like the world. You got all these men even dressing like the world, dressing feminine. It is what it is. I'm not going to back down. I'm going to keep saying what I'm saying. But this is bananas, man. Absolutely ridiculous.